What's up, powerful people? My name is Eli. You can call me Super Kid, and I'm here to welcome you to part 10 of the Undertale Absolutely Blind playthrough here on Super Kid Plays. Powerful people, if you're excited for this episode, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and ring the notification bell. Leave me any comments you have in the comment section, and please share this video with anyone you think might like it. Now let's continue looking continue looking around Dr. Alphys' lab. The, that last question, he was he wasn't supposed to ask that one. Yeah, I, I got that. I have seven health. I need to I need to heal. Wait, wait. Let me give you my phone number. Then maybe if you need help, I could help me. Where'd you get that phone? It's ancient. It doesn't even have texting. Wait a second, please. <laughs> Here, I upgraded it for you. It can do texting, items, it's got a keychain. I even signed you up for the Underground's number one social network. Now we're officially friends. <laughs> I'm going to the bathroom. <laughs> That was cool. The fridge is filled with instant noodles and soda. Yeah, I'll take a package of noodles. Where's the save point? Outdoors? Out of doors? Over here, that's right. Yes, I shall save the game. And then we'll go back in here. Uh, a garbage can, but it's pretty cute. Okay. It's a computer. It's accessing some kind of puzzle in Snowden. It's a beat-up figurine of a female human with cat ears. Okay. It's a half-empty bag of dog food. He just remembered something funny. What was the funny thing, I wonder? It's a bathroom sign. Scientific books. They seem very dusty. Are they all like that? VHSs and DVDs of various cartoons. They are all labeled human history. All these books are labeled human history. Read one. You look inside a book. It's a comic of a giant robot fighting a beautiful alien princess. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. No, it does not. Yeah, I'll read some more human history. It's a comic book. Two scantily clad chefs are flinging energy pancakes at each other. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. No, it doesn't. Yeah, let's read another one. A hideous android is running to school with toast in his mouth. Its mouth. Seems like it's late. <laughs> Pink goop drips from this strange machine. It does indeed. Looks like Alphys's work table seems dusty. Okay. The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats and a single clean dress. There are letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. There's a lamp with a pink fish on the lampshade. There's no light bulb. An incredible invention. But not in use. This bed folds into an extremely easy to draw box. That's awesome. It's a promo poster for Metaton's TV premiere. On the flap it says, Thank you for making my dreams come true. That's cute. It's a teacup shaped like a yellow lizard. It's full of soda. Nice. We'll just head over here. Oh, that's the back of the lab. Well, we'll continue looking through the lab first. What's in here? The space behind the wall is only a few feet wide. Okay. Can't go in the bathroom, huh? 
All right. Just realized I didn't watch Undyne fight the human. Hmm. Well, I know she's unbeatable. I'll ask her about it later. Well, I did- I did beat her. For now, I gotta call up the human and guide them. That's true, you do. Stop updating your status and call me. Vulcan? I like this guy. Let's check him out. Mistakenly believes that Slava can heal people. Thunder, helpful. Speed up! Whoa! Wow. Can't believe I didn't get hit by that. Vulcan is making coffee in its crater. Really? Not anymore. Okay. Gonna call them in a minute. Alright. Whoa. This is pretty wild. This place looks really cool. Music is tight. The whooshing sound of steam and cogs, it fills you with determination. Here in Hotland Magma Chamber, it certainly does. I hate using the phone. I don't want to do this, Lamel. Too bad. Whoa. Sundra plane gets in the way, not on purpose or anything. <laughs> okay. Was that perfect? That was tight. I think I got three perfect hits there. <laughs> this is like Portal. I love it. Oh my god, I've had my claw over the last digit for five minutes. Oh my god, I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna call. Yeah, why don't you? Whoever was calling hung up before you answered it. How grand. Uh, hi, so the blue lasers... Uh, I mean, Alpha's here. Hi. The blue lasers won't hurt you if you don't move. Uh, orange ones, um, you have to be moving and they, um, they won't, um, move through those ones. Uh, bye. Oh my god, I did it. Claws haven't shook like that since Undyne called me to ask about the weather. Wait, there's no weather down here. Why did she call me? Damn it. Son of a bitch. That's so weird. It's really, it's like a brain, a brain bender. It's a switch. Press it? Yeah, I'll press it. The lasers were deactivated. Oh, cool. That's outstanding. Oh my god, I forgot to tell them where to go. That's true, you did. Cute pic of me right now. It's a photo of a garbage can with several pink glittery filters over it. Okay. Oh, shit. Alpha's here. The, the northern door will stay locked until you solve the puzzles on the right and left. I think you should go to the right first. Okay. Who are these cool cats? The way to work is blocked, so I had time to catch my Metaton show... To catch Metaton show on my phone. The special effects were amazing today. That human almost looked real. Metaton? Yeah. He's the most popular star in the underground. His fan club probably has at least two, no, three dozen members. Nice. I like this guy with the cup. Wonder if it would be unfun if I explained the puzzle. Hmm. 
Hmm. Hmm. The door leading through the area is closed, so I tried the puzzle, but I keep I kept running out of ammo, so I and I kept it kept resetting. And my two coworkers won't help. It's like they don't even want to go to work. Yeah, it is like that. Shoot the opposing ship. Move the boxes to complete your mission. Oh, okay. All right, I got it. Got that one. I think. Whoops. I keep jumping the gun. There we go. There we go. Alphys, here. That blue laser seems totally impassable, but... As the royal scientist, I have some tricks up my sleeve. I'll hack into the Hotland laser database and take it out. Click. Thank you. Finally, someone turned off that laser. Now that we're free, we can... Well, uh... I guess we'll just keep standing here. <laughs> we were hanging out when suddenly a bunch of... A bunch of puzzles reactivated out of nowhere. This is a huge problem. It rules. They've got to cancel school over this. That's awesome. Same as before. Okay. Oh, wow. Um... God um Seems like that one wasn't really that hard either. Now that I know what I'm doing. Somewhat. Dang it! This is harder than the puzzles. Alright. Hell yeah. Like a noisy ass door like that. Whatever, I'll just explain it. Uh, I think, um, hey, about the puzzles on the left and right, they're a bit difficult to explain, but, uh, you already solved them? Awesome. It is awesome, isn't it? Wow. Hey, it's kind of dark in there, isn't it? Don't worry. Oh, God, what is he gonna, what am I gonna see? Oh. Oh no. Oh god. <laughs> Welcome beauties to the Underground's premiere cooking show. Cooking with a killer robot. Preheat your ovens because we've got a very special recipe for you today. We're going to be making a cake. Excuse me, my lovely assistant here will gather the ingredients. Yes, I shall. Sorry. Everyone, give them a big hand. Oh, thanks. Thanks, everyone. We'll need sugar, milk, and eggs. Okay, go for it, sweetheart. I found the sugar. I found the milk found the eggs. Perfect. Great job, beautiful. We've got all the ingredients we need to bake the cake. Milk sugar eggs. Oh my. Wait a magnificent moment. How could I forget? We're missing the most important ingredient. Oh god. A human soul. You really forgot? Oh, sorry, that's me. Oh no, it's him. 
Hello, I'm kind of in the middle of something here. Wait a second. Can you make a... Couldn't you use a... Couldn't you make a substitution in the recipe? A substitution? You mean use a different non-human ingredient? Why? Uh... What if s someone's... Vegan? Vegan. Oh, well, I mean, that's a brilliant idea, Alphys. Actually, I happen to have an option right here. MTT brand always. Convenient human soul flavor substitute. A can of which is just over on that counter. Okay. Well, darling, why don't you go get it? Okay. Hmm. By the way, our show runs on a strict schedule. If you can't get the can in the next one minute, we'll just have to go back to the original plan. I better start climbing, beautiful. Oh no, there's not enough time to climb up. Fortunately, I might have a plan. When I was upgrading your phone, I added a few features. You see that huge button that says jetpack? <laughs> uh, tight. There. You should have just enough fuel to reach the top. Now, get up there. Uh. <laughs> this is awesome. Oh, man. Dude, the puzzles in this game are so creative. Oh, jeez. Uh, no. Son of a bitch. Did I not get it? My, my. Seems you've bested me. Oh, good. But only because you had the help of the brilliant Dr. Alphys. Oh, I loathe to think what would have happened to you without her. Well, toodles. Oh, yes. About the substitution. Haven't you ever seen a cooking show before? I already baked the cake ahead of time, so forget it. Yeah. Where, whose soul did you use? Wow, we, we did it. We, we really did it. Great job out there, team. Well, uh, anyway, let's keep heading forward. Okay. An ominous structure looms in the distance. You're filled with determination. Core view. See that building in the distance? Yeah, of course. It's the core, the source of all power for the underground. It converts geothermal energy into magical electricity by... Uh, anyway, that's where we're going to go. In the core is an elevator directly to Asgore's castle. And from there, you can go home. Great. That sounds fantastic. Elevator, huh? Please select a location. Uh, um, left floor one? This is like the Great Glass Elevator from Willy Wonka. That goes like all directions, not just up and down. Um... Oh, we're back at the lab. Very interesting. Wonder where the boat takes you. But I kind of... Kind of want to keep looking around here. Um, right floor one. That's where we were. Right? 
Let's check right floor two. That sound reminds me of like the Jetsons. Whoa, what up, dude? I'm Heat's Fl I'm Heat's Flamesman. I love that name. Remember my name, Heat's Flamesman. Okay, I'll try. Um, is this where we've already been? Dinner with the girlfriend? It's a picture of a cat girl figurine next to a bowl of instant noodles. Oh yeah, the noodles. What do those do? Uh, heals HP. I don't know how much though. Ooh, high rope bounds towards you. Is it cold in here? Uh, no. It's not cold in here at all. We're in like a volcano, dude. What are you talking about? My love increased. Hell yeah. Oh, where the fuck am I? Whoa. Knapstablook has sent you a friend request. Oh, what up, dude? Yeah, I'll accept your request. There's an apron lying on the ground. Will you take it? Yes. A stained apron. Whoa. I'm gonna use that. What do I have now? Okay, those, the cloudy glasses is what I had before. Which made you invincible longer after you got hit. Might be a good thing to have. I think I did come this way already, perhaps. I'm not 100% sure. Oh, jeez. Um... <laughs> You're hurt, I'll help you. Dude, when you have more than one enemy, it gets so chaotic on that screen. <laughs> um... Damn it. It's making coffee in its crater. I won, yay. Yay. Okay. So this is right too. I'll go to left floor one, go back to the lab, go check out the boat lady or guy or whatever. Or maybe I won't, you know? I don't even know what I'm going to do. I'm definitely going to do this. Excellent. tra -la -la, I am the river man, or am I the river woman? Doesn't really matter. I love to ride in my boat. Would you care to join me? Yes. Oh, shit. That's awesome. I don't actually want to go anywhere. But I'm glad I now know this. Can I just go straight back? This is pretty cool, actually. Ah. That's it? <laughs> oh, I remember this spot. Come again sometime. Tra la la. Yes, I would care for a ride back to the laboratory, please. Hotland. Hotlanta! Time's almost up. Once we get back, we'll save the game and uh, wrap up the episode. Powerful people, what do you think? Hmm. The room before the darkening lantern room. Oh, that's right. I remember that. Okay, here we are. Thank you, tra la la. All right, powerful people. 
Man, we survived the cooking show. That was pretty cool. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and ring the notification bell. Leave any comments you have for me in the comment section, and please share this video with anybody you think might like it. Um, until next time, powerful people. My name is Eli. You can call me Super Kid. Thank you so much for watching. Stay safe. Peace. And love. <laughs>